Break bread, puss ass niggas. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Break hey, bread. but you know, I if I okay, so mistake me if I'm wrong, right? The other day I was scrolling, I don't know if I was scrolling to IG or Facebook or something, but supposedly he he was gonna give bonuses to his employees. That was he great. has to. He has to. And then he... go ahead, go ahead. I'm sorry. And then the other thing was that he was gonna donate some money. I'm I'm not sure if it was like to schools or but he was gonna just let me just say donate some money. I, I'm not sure what exactly what he was gonna donate to, but he was definitely gonna donate some money. Bro, he has to, bro. Like, come on, man. Like, I, I I make I make like two pennies, and people be on the street begging me for money. And I I want my oh, do you want to donate to the hospital and that bullshit? I'm like, man, man, bro, I, I'm fucked up, bro. This nigga made a go, trillion fucking dollars, bro. Go go call Amazon guy to go help out. <laughs> oh, my, yo, this this nigga Jeff Bezos can be out here some real Batman and Iron Man shit, bro. Trying to save the world, dog. Nobody, nobody in this entire country in the United States of America, in the world for that matter, should be having a fucked up Christmas when this nigga making a trillion fucking dollars, bro. Nope. Nobody in this whole world should have a fucked up Christmas, nigga. Everybody should get to get a thousand dollars on the house from Jeff Bezos. Like, here you go, my nigga. Y'all ball the fuck Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Now, check this out. Check this out. With this man making all that money, all that money, I'm pretty sure he can he could save world hunger, bro. Oh my God, yeah. <laughs> of course. Yeah, no, he can end. Poverty. True that. You can't end poverty, bro. True enough. He needs to send out a stimulus check, bro. Come on. <laughs> yeah, facts. <laughs> you know, this reminds me. This reminds me of that movie, Bad Santa. Billy Bob is telling um the guy. You know, the I, I don't know how to say this, so I, I'm gonna just say little person. I don't know what they they like being called. I think uh, dwarf. 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 No, I think it's little people. I think that's the term, if well, I'm correct. No. So he goes. So he's like, "Yo, I mean, look at all that shit. I mean, do you really need all that shit? Because he's looking at all the stuff that he done stole from the mall and everything, and it's like this big, huge shit. He's like, "Yo, do you really need that?" So my whole thing with Jeff Bezos is like, "Bro, you do you really need all that money?" <laughs> <laughs> like, how can you? How can you need all that money, son? You don't need all that money. I was so watching I'm just saying, dog. I was watching you know something saying? the other day that it said that if for you to count to one to ten, it's like a few seconds. One to one to to a hundred, it, it, it's like a like a like a couple like a, a minute or some shit that. For you to count to a million, it's going to take you six, uh, like a month. And to, to count to a billion, to count to a billion, it's going to take you six months, bro. It's fucking crazy, bro. Hmm. Can, can, you imagine a tri- can you imagine a trillion? I'm talking counting. One, two, three, four. It's going to take you fucking months, bro. A trillion fucking dollars, bro. Like, That's like, like bro. they got the counting machine, bro. <laughs> hmm. Like, bro, that's the, bro, that's fucking ridiculous. And that nigga, he, but my boy, my boy can walk up on Bill Gates and be like, my nigga, get your money up, bro. <laughs> get your money bro, up, broke ass, broke ass, broke bitch. Ass. <laughs> get your money up, nigga. Oh my god. I'm sick of, I'm sick of you, broke motherfuckers, man. Every time I see you broke niggas, my skin itch, my nigga. <laughs> nigga, I'm, nigga, I'm, oh my God. nigga, I'm Santa Claus, nigga. Tighten up. Bill Gates is like, bro, I fucking hate this guy. Hmm. He always, he always stunting on me. Always want to stun on me, like, bro. Like, fuck you, Jeff. Fucking Bill Gates. Bill, Bill Gates pulls up in the fucking space shuttle, right? 
You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, I see me, boy. I fuck with. I bought NASA, NASA nigga. You know what I'm saying? Ooh, ooh, ooh. And fucking my man, my man Jeff Bezos pulls up in a fucking UFO, nigga. <laughs> like, what's happening? What's happening? I fuck, I fuck with the people, bro. What's up? I'm good over there, bro. Oh my god! He got he got property. He got property in Mars. You know what I'm saying? He picked up the UFO at, at the dealership. You know what I'm saying? Brand new, no miles. Oh my lord! Stunting. Mm-mm. That is no, fuck it. I'm done. I'm done talking about Jeff Bezos. Que me estoy complando. No, no. Hey, nigga, you should be. That nigga richer than God, nigga. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god, I can't. Killing the game, boy. Killing the fucking game. Oh my god, I can't. I can't. You know you you know you stunting when you got more money than God, boy. Come on, come on, man. That my man dies. And, and and goes to hell and he's like, hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, Satan, check this out, bro. I ain't really for this working hard shit, nigga. How much money you need, my nigga? My nigga, I'm the, I'm the prince of darkness, my nigga. I don't need money, nigga. My nigga, yeah, I'll bill you out, well, son. Nigga, everybody got a price, bro. On some million, on some million dollar man shit, nigga. Everybody got a price, baby. Facts. What's going on? That's I can make it. Facts. I, I can make it happen. Mm-mm. That shit is crazy. Oh, the, million, the million dollar man, boy, it, it's fucked up that that the million dollar man died broke, bro. Ted DiBiase, remember the million dollar man? Yeah, I seen I seen a meme. I seen a meme about that. That it was uh Ted DiBiase with Hulk Hogan, and it was like, all right, so. <laughs> Here's here's a picture of here's a picture of the million dollar man, and there's Ted DiBiase. I was like, golly. Hulk Hogan, Hulk Hogan got 150 million off a of sex tape. Nice, nice. I wonder, boy. I, I can, can you imagine? God damn. We're doing something wrong, boy. We're doing oh, something wrong. No, that's that's, <laughs> that's macho man. That's macho man. My fault. My fault. Hulk Hogan, like, what you gonna do, girl? (laughs) (laughs) When the Hulkster busts nuts on you. You know what I'm saying? (laughs) Can you imagine? Oh my God. Yo. But yeah, man. Christmas traditions. Mine is getting drunk and let me see. Okay, gotta have the pork. Gotta have the pork laying down. Getting smoked, um, the pen, the 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 rice with the beans, the yuca. You know what I mean? That's that's what goes down at the house. The fucking cooler full of uh, or the or the fridge rather, full of Heinekens and Bex's. Um, uh, coquito, and gotta have a bottle of Bacardi. You gotta have a coquito, and then you gotta have a bottle of Bacardi, because motherfuckers don't want to drink coquito. The one, the, the one fifty one, baby. Oh, that's a fact. I'm gonna be honest with y'all. Like me and the wife, we just gonna order a pizza this year, bro. We just gonna, we just gonna. Order. I mean, we put the tree up, we put the lights up, we bought gifts and stuff like that, but like. Other than that, yo, we are exhausted, bro. Now that we had the last couple of days of the 2020, bro. Notice I said the 2020. I didn't say the year 2020. I said the 2020. Like, like my nigga, like Friday the 13th, bro. This year has been Friday the 13th the whole fucking year, bro. Facts. Whew. Yeah. Straight up facts. This year has been fucking exhausting, bro. Exhausting, bro. Like, bro. And the and the last quarter has been the no my November was was sucky, bro. Like for for nami kuto la mena, bro. Like ah, damn it, bro. Mm-mm. This fucking bird won't shut the fuck up. Yo, I'm in production, mm-hmm. nigga. 
<laughs> hey, but this nigga is animals. This nigga always trying to abuse animals, bro. <laughs> don't ma- don't mace the fucking bird, bro. Don't mace the bird. <laughs> So oh big. my god. Yo, this guy. Yo, let's kick it up a notch, right? Let's let's talk about your dishes, right? Let's talk about your dishes when when it becomes toxic. Okay. And you and you you become the 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 one to to break that cycle. Mm. Like how how does one cause cause you know you grow up in, in, um, doing, you know, these traditions, and you think that it's normal, right? You think that that's how how everything should be, and then you know you be you become like the black sheep of the family, mm. and you start learning about other stuff, right? Uh-huh. And then you come to realize, you come to realize that some of these things, some of these traditions, are not really healthy for you, you know. And then you start breaking that cycle and you start making your own traditions. And then like, how, how does some people, or, or just, let's just talk in general because sometimes when, when I, I've seen, you know, in different cultures, when they break traditions, like their families begin to dishonor them, have them separated and stuff like that and, and they don't and they don't sometimes realize that that tradition is, is toxic but they just keep going ain't that something not, not true no i don't i don't agree with you um, they, i think they do know it's toxic but that's all they know <laughs> that's, that, that's is that um, all they know that's all they know so and, and it, if i dealt with it you got to deal with it, too. The fuck? Doesn't that become a little bit too... Uh, is it selfish? Or, if I'm looking for the word selfish? Is that the word I'm looking for? Is it is it selfish if it's all you know? Uh, uh, well, I'm talking... I'm actually... Let me reverse that. Let me, let, me, let, me, let me go back to that. When someone decides to break that tradition... And start something new and healthy. Why? Why usually like families? Well, not families. Again, let me bring it back. That person that decides to do a little bit things a little bit different. The resistance, right? Are called selfishness. They're they're called selfish because they're only thinking about themselves and not everybody else. Well, that's that's the you know that's the burden of a, of a revolutionary. You know, like when you rebel, yeah, they, you are gonna be like, you know, like when the slaves rebel against the slave masters. They're like, what the fuck you doing, bro? Ain't you, ain't you happy being a slave? You know, you so that's that's part of being a, a revolutionary. When you step out, when you step out of the line, when you step out of the line, they're gonna do everything in your power to put you back in line. But you got you gotta stand firm. But then it comes to this, right, where. Those who are still doing their traditions are not very open for change. It becomes hard for them to to accept change. Doesn't that become toxic each generation that that brings it down to? No, it, it becomes it becomes more toxic. It, it, it's to- compounded it's toxic level on top of another toxic level you know it's it, it becomes like generational you know from grandma from great 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 grandma to great great grandma to grandma to mom to daughter to granddaughter you know it becomes generational but it all it all depends on the person like you know, it, 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 some somebody somebody started that tradition, and, it's, and and on that same breath, somebody can end it. True enough. Somebody can end it. You, just like I mean, you, you gotta you know, be the black sheep, and pesado, the asshole. You know, saying like, oh, okay, can my make out of I can't stand her. You know, I hate my cousin. Type of shit. You know, but you go, you have to. You, you gotta break. You gotta break that shit. You have to break the cycle. 
or you're going to force your kids to go to that same shit, that same toxic shit that you went through. Mm-hmm. Like was, motherfuckers, motherfuckers call and be like, uh, my bad, son. No, nah, you good, you good. No, nah, motherfuckers call and be like, oye, Emilio está ahí? ¿Quién está ahí? Emilio está ahí? Si me, oye, si me mira mal, lo despingo. <laughs> like, yes, like, nigga, why, why? Why, 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 why are you upsetting, <laughs> why are you upsetting the herd, my nigga? Why are you, you know what I mean? Like are already, already putting that bad juju. <laughs> exactly. You know, then you pull up, you know what I'm saying? And it's and it's and it's a weird vibe. Nah man, yep. I mean yeah, and, and, and toxic ooh, toxic tradition. Yeah. Toxic Not only does traditions. it become a weird vibe, right? Not only because of weird vibe, but it becomes like um fake. You're being fake with your family. Yeah. You're all gathered up for holidays. Oh my God! Yeah, Merry Christmas, uh, Happy Hanukkah, whatever, and all these other traditions. Oh my God! Yeah, but at the but deep inside, you're like, let that person look at me the wrong way, boy. I'm ready to, I'm ready yeah. to knock somebody out. That's so fake. Like I, I can't, I can't do that. Can't do it. Can't do it. You shouldn't do it. Can't do it. I mean, you me fight. First. You fight on Christmas and then you make up on New Year's. Like, come on, man. <laughs> I wish, I I wish I had the space to be around, like be around people I don't like. Though. I can't be around people that I don't like, bro. And that's and that's a tradition that that I'm breaking. You know what I'm saying with with, with my family and you know, that bullshit. You know, and if you don't like a motherfucker, you don't have to stand them. You don't have mm-hmm. you don't have to stand them. You don't have to you don't have to be polite. You don't have to say hello, man. If if you don't like this person, this it completely ignore that motherfucker, and 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 that's it. Just be about your business. That's it. I don't, I don't like you. You don't like me. That's it. Fuck it. Let's, let's keep it moving, bro. You gotta be here. I gotta be here. That's it. Fuck fuck. Mm. Man. Don't be a don't be a slave to a fucking tradition, man. Mm. That's the truth. That's a cold. Hard truth. I was reading a a meme the other day that said, um, "The ones who break the generational curses, uh, no, the the generational patterns of of you know family traditions and all this stuff are usually those uh, that are the black sheep of the family because they see through everyone's bullshit." Tell you. I mean, there's one. There's one. There's one more tradition. That I want to break. Okay. That I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pour every ounce, everything that I that I learned, not just in 2020, but over over my 36 years to overcoming. I want to end the tradition of being poor, bro, mm. of being broke, of being That's- broke. I'm tired. I'm sick and tired of being grateful for 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 scraps, bro. I'm tired of it, bro. I'm le- I'm fucking. I'm fed up. I'm re- I'm ready to go, Karen, nigga. I'm ready to go, mm. Karen. You know what I'm saying? And call and, and talk to the manager, nigga, about nigga. Why the fuck am I still poor? <laughs> That's real. That's it, man. That's that's the next tradition I want to break, bro. Um, I gotta say that I've broken a lot of traditions in my family, and that starts off with the way that I treat my kids, the way I talk to them, the way that I that I communicate with them. Definitely has been a very big generational uh, like I stopped it completely I mean even even before even before 2020 uh, I don't know man everybody's just so fucking bitter and mad and uptight and angry and it's like bro you know so I need to break break that tradition as well. Like you know what I'm saying? That that feeling 
I don't know, like through throughout years, yo, I've turned kind of into a, a Scrooge, except without the money. Mm. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Without the money, boy. So it's like fuck. <laughs> It's like it's like Christmas. This is December, you know what I'm saying? Christmas, everything, but it don't feel like Christmas. You know what I mean? It's 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 mm. what does Christmas feel like? You know what yeah, I, mean? I don't know, sir. I don't know. I gotta say that this is the first year where I'm not excited for I got, Christmas. Wait, wait, I got I got an answer. I, I got an answer. Okay. I got an answer for what, what Christmas feels like. Christmas feels like fakeness. Yeah. Christmas yeah. feels like fakeness, bro. Because you got, you got, oh, cheer up, be jolly, be merry. Oh, it's a merry Christmas. No, I'm not. No, it, it, I, I don't, I don't want to feel that way, bro. But you forced me to fit, to get in a jolly mood and a merry. In the in the Christmassy mood, bro. Because I don't want to be the Grinch. I don't want to be the Scrooge. Fuck that, bro. Fuck that. That's why I said that society pushes this it's, upon us. It's December twenty. You know, it's it's December twenty fifth, nigga, and I still feel like shit, bro. The fuck, my life hurts, bro. The fuck. Let me be mad, bro. Yo, me, 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 duele la, me duele la vida, huh? That, you, feel, you feeling like Capitan? Come on, man. Come on, man. Me duele la vida, boy. I, I wish, I wish that every holiday, holidays, you automatically feel good, dog. I wish life was that simple, bro, but it's not. Yeah. It's not. It's they not. have to, you got to normalize that it's okay to feel like crap. During holidays, yeah. it's okay. Yeah, man. It's okay. Not everybody's gonna be happy. Not everybody's gonna be all excited. Not everybody's gonna jump I, for joy. I really feel. I really feel. That's why people, you know, what I'm saying, look for the exit, dog, I and mean, jump out, jump out of a, jump off a fucking bridge or some shit, dog, because they they feel trapped, dog. They can't express themselves, bro. Mm. Oh, I got, I got, I got, I got to go to my mama's house. I got to go to. To 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 dinner with my with my in laws and shit like that, but nigga, I feel nigga, I just got fired from my job, mm. my nigga. You know what I'm saying? I'm broke as shit. Yeah. Nigga, my mortgage is up. Right. Right, right. Nigga, it's okay, nigga. Yo, nigga, talk to me, bro. Fuck Merry. If, if you feel like fuck Merry Christmas, me, Lou, I I want you to fuck Merry Christmas, fuck Christmas, and fuck all that shit. Fuck Santa Claus too. That nigga been owing me for years, nigga. <laughs> I've been wanting a, 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 a fucking Sega Genesis for years, my nigga. Fucking ass nigga. I know I nigga got my list. I'm talking about 93, 94 shit right now, bro. I'm, I'm traumatized. I got triggered. This guy. Oh, <laughs> nigga, yeah, it happens. <laughs> Santa Claus going to the Goja. Oh, hey, what's that one gift y'all wanted for Christmas hmm. but never got? Well, I got mine. I, I I got myself a uh, my mama my mama got me a, a Super Nintendo way back way back when in the nineties like ninety two ninety three ninety two or some shit like that whenever that shit came out okay. she got me one but okay. but then like a couple months later she yeah that that killed Christmas for me mm. Mm. I think uh <laughs> I, I think for yeah. Christmas uh, I think the Oh, the 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 one gift that I that I never got. Damn. I I think I've gotten what I wanted for Christmas, but not at the time. You know what I'm saying? So eventually, eventually, everything I wanted for Christmas, I got. Ooh, another another tradition, boy. Being single on Christmas. Ugh. No, they gotta normalize that. Like, it's okay. It's okay to be single during Christmas. Like, what the hell? Like, why do we need to have? Why do we have to be in a relationship or be what? It, what's that word? The uh, cuffed season, yeah. whatever they want to call it. 
like why like let's normalize it it's okay people to be single it's okay to be in a relationship it's okay everything is okay like i can't i hate when they frown upon these things during the holidays it's okay like so listen what it's okay to be sad it's okay to be lonely yes. it's okay to be lonely yes. it's okay not to have nobody to tell you merry christmas no that bullshit Fuck yes, all that. Agree. Fuck all that. It's so that's okay. If you lonely, you have time to focus on yourself and get and, and get reacquainted with yourself, bro. If you are nobody, yep. if you have nobody to buy a gift to, guess what? That means there's more money for you, bro. Absolutely. Come on, man. Preach your shit. Gotta, Ooh, gotta man. look at the price like, side. Like, that, that's why people. That, oh. That's why people look for their exit, bro, because they they. There's nobody telling them shit like this, bro. Like, oh no, 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 no. If 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 you if you don't got if you don't got a man in your life around this time, you ain't shit. If you don't got a female in your life at this time, you ain't shit. Oh, if, if you don't find your wife the Mercedes Benz and some shit, you ain't shit. I mean, fuck that, bro. Like, come on, man. Fuck out of here. She want a Benz, buy her some Benz. <laughs> Stop telling me, bro. You gotta you gotta do what makes you happy. That's it. You do what makes you happy. What? Oh, there was something that I read the other day, right? That it that it said it said that a lot of people are always coming up to like their friends and family members, right? And they're always asking them, "Oh, um, uh, did you get a, did you buy a house yet? Oh, did you did you get married yet? Oh, did you have your kids yet? Oh, are you planning to have kids? All of these questions, right?" But the one question that no one ever asks anybody is, are you happy? I'm saying, how you doing? Yeah. I, are you happy? I think the term, with the way your life is going. I think the term for that is um, societal pressure. Mm. You know, societal pressure. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That's a real. That's that's a real thing, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, it, 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 and it all depends on the the demographic that you in, the, the people you. People you fuck with, peer mm-hmm. pressure is a motherfucker. Yeah. Peer pressure, oh, yeah. pressure is a motherfucker, bro. Like it, it's only now, thirty six years old. I thirty six years old. I, I, I understand the concept of, of peer pressure. I never done it before because a motherfucker never made me smoke coke or, or smoke crack or, or put a needle in my arm or shit like that. I'm gonna leave, boy. Crack. You know? <laughs> <laughs> but, but, but hear me out, though. Like this all the peer. That's all they told us about peer pressure. That's all they told us. Oh, it's drug related. It's drug related. Yeah. Drug related. It's not about that's true. Being unhappy in a relationship for 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 six seven years. You know, saying just to be in a relationship. True. You know, you know, you just want your pride to do some shit just to be in it. Ah oh, man, come on man. There's, there's different levels of peer pressure, bro. That's a fact. You, you going? No, 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 no. He, he, he dropping news for- today. This motherfucker hot. For real, boy. He he's on the. This motherfucker <laughs> like Jordan today, boy. Just <laughs> just just dropping number threes. <laughs> shrugging, oh, boy. shrugging the shoulders. You know what I'm saying? This is so, what I. It's true, what though. I do, son. You going somewhere with that? That's true. But it, but it, That's all I remember about peer pressure. Definitely only about drugs. Yeah. I never heard about no, nothing about like you know being happy, unhappy. Uh, oh, you gotta work this bad job over here. You gotta you gotta clean this over here. You know nothing of that nature but peer pressure for drugs. And it's like wait a minute, you going somewhere and, with that? In our era, we grew up. We grew up going to school in the nineties and and in the thousands and stuff like that. That school system failed. Yeah. They, yeah. They, they felt it, bro. They felt it. Because, because me completely me, me personally, me personally, nigga, I failed I failed I failed all the shit, nigga. Like like the I did like as far as peer pressure goes, I didn't smoke crack, I didn't smoke um cocaine, I didn't smoke heroin heroin which we don't know. But I felt everything else I got pressured in that tradition got that. Yeah. 
All right, son. That's a fact. But you know what I'm saying? What you're saying is true, but dog, stop. You need to stop mentioning crack, dog. You keep, you keep, you keep bringing <laughs> up crack. A fucking crackhead gonna pop up on you like Candyman. It's like, I'm telling you. <laughs> stop you it. You got crack? <laughs> For real, boy. Something. Like, what a crack at, boy? It's just crazy. <laughs> Yeah, but yeah, definitely. Oh man! Yeah, definitely that's some real shit. Drugs are. Drugs are real, son. Drugs are real, though. You know what I'm saying? Like, 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 like here we are. You know what I'm saying? Like, we having a conversation about about these demons of ours, bro. We're not we're not doing drugs. We're not. You know, I hope we're not having suicidal thoughts and no shit like that. You know, so we, no, we're having that. a conversation. Um, that's how you cook. Because somebody, somebody needs to hear this. Hear this. I mean, <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you, though. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take your quote. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's, it's, it's killing, it's killing off the person that you no longer want to be anymore. So, definitely want to make some changes about myself. You know what I'm saying? As far as me, nah, I'm not on that type of time. You know what I'm saying? And for those, and for those that that are on that type of time, you know what I mean? I mean, I hope you get through it. I hope you can overcome it. You know what I'm saying? Because that's something that's very, you know, that's that's very sad. You know, it's, it's it's a horrible thing. You know what I mean? But as far as like with me, I just want to make changes within myself. You know what I'm saying? Make improvements and break. Those those damn traditions, those toxic traditions, and um, that's a fact. That's it, you know. I mean, if you don't break those traditions, you fucked. You fucked in the game. You yeah. lose. You have to break them. Yeah. We gotta evolve. You have to, yo, um, uh, my boys. What's that boy named Charles Dal- Charles Darwin? He was a cool kid. He was a cokehead, but he but he said it back then. Yo, you evolve, evolve or die, mm. bro. That's the whole theory of, of of evolution, bro. You have to change. That you have to get better. What 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 my boy said, Albert Albert Einstein about about insanity. You you, you can't do the same thing over and over again, and, and expect expect a different result. That's the definition of Correct. that's the definition of insa- insanity, bro. Mm. So true. That's real shit. You have to to get you have to change to get different results. You gotta do you gotta do something. You have, to, you have to change. Yo, this this year, yo, I've been talking about Kobe Bryant all day, bro. Yeah. All day I've been talking since, since last call me this morning. We've been, we've been talking about Kobe Bryant, bro. The fucking black mamba. He said, if you, if you want to be a legend, you gotta do legendary shit, bro. I call me Brian, bro. Yeah, real shit. You got to. You can't do the same shit what just over happened? and over. You got you have to change, bro. Tra- traditions, boy. That that's a that's definitely such a uh a, a, a it's a powerful thing and yet the word it, it, it the, the the meaning behind that is so powerful traditions you have you, you you have to at some point in your life man realize that like you don't have to keep doing the same thing you ain't gotta be doing like what 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 your grandma used to do what your auntie used to do and like you don't have to <sighs> you really don't have to and also if your family sucks get your own family and that make your own make your own family. Facts, so true. Oh, Christmas time. Uh, hey man, we can't we can't choose the family that we're born into, bro. If that was a if, if that was if that was like untrue, I would have been <laughs> nigga Jeff Bezos' son, bro. <laughs> for real. Yeah, for real, boy. You know what I hate? 
I hate when, when people like to say something like in the words of, oh, but at the end of the day, that's your mom and, and you got to love her and just try to all uh, 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 her toxicity. No, 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 son. Let me tell you, son. Whether it's family members, whether it's friends, whether it's people just that I encounter every day, but if you're toxic, you toxic. You gotta get away from that. I believe that. I, I believe that anybody in your life mm. can get cut off, bro. Anybody. But if you are, or you are, if you are not essential, essential to to my growth, you gotta go. I'm sorry, bro. I'm not gonna kill you. I'm just gonna go fuck with you. That's it. You go, you go your way. I go my way. Yeah. My, my, my first marriage taught me that, dog. Because like, you know, dealing with dealing dealing with a person in a situation that you're not supposed to be in, number one, can reveal who you are and put you in a real, real bad toxic situation, bro. It, 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 it just gets bad. It just gets worse and worse and worse and worse and worse and worse. And worse. Because it's 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 un, it's unnatural. It's unnatural. And then I, I don't fuck with you. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I don't like you. That's it. Like, you know, it, it, it doesn't matter if we are brothers, brother and sister, cousins, my mother, father, yo, hey, I'm sorry, bro. Like did, like I understand that you, you gave birth to me. I understand that shit, but like yo. I can't fuck with you. I I I don't know how to talk to you. You don't know how to talk to me. All, all we do is respect each other. Look, I rather not take it there. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna stay in my lane, and you stay in yours, bro. I, I wish you the best. And it's not wrong. With, Yo, it's not wrong what? with that. It's not yeah. wrong with that. And that and and things like that has to get yeah. Normalized. It's not wrong with that. Things like that gotta get normalized, bro. I hate all that, no, because you're you're disrespecting your family, you're disrespecting your mama, you're disrespecting your mama, man. What is this, son? Así no se estaba la, yeah. la, la pura. Mal hijo. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. Yeah, come on, I've been, man, I've been told, I've been told, yo no tengo que respetarte a ti, pero tú tienes que respetarme a mí. I was like, what? Nah, you That's gotta, you gotta, you gotta give That's respect horrible. to get respect. That that makes no sense. So you sense. can talk to me any kind of fucking way, and yeah. and, and and I gotta be fine it with that, sense. and I gotta kiss your ass and do whatever the fuck it is that you that you tell me. You crazy as hell. Mm-mm. That's crazy. Yeah, that's that's mm-hmm. fucking. That's, I mean, uh, look, 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 and and the culture that we're talking about is our culture, not your culture, not whoever's listening to culture, but this is our culture. So that's yeah. just fucking insane, bro. Cause, cause me, like, yo, like, man, like the way, the way, the way I was raised, I wouldn't raise my kids like that, bro. I wouldn't. Mm, that's mm. a fact. True. I would. I wouldn't, though. Like, 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 I, I can't. I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't do it. Yeah, they and, don't. And the they don't deserve is, that. I think. I think the thing is that it's a good thing that you realize that that's that's not the way to raise your children. It's not. It's not the right way. It's not healthy. You know Unfortunately, what I'm saying? Like, you had to go through all that craziness, but you're you are evolving. This is why, this is why, like, you know, like, hold on, because the, tr- the train is coming. I got to mute myself. <laughs> okay. <laughs> wow. This guy lives next to the train. <laughs> <laughs> all types, all types of sound effects in, in, in this, in this podcast. Train, oh, bird, chihuahuas, kids, children, yeah, forklifts. 
<laughs> Mind you, we still, we live in the same neighborhood, but the train the train track is a little bit farther from my house. So yeah, but definitely um. <laughs> if, if anybody looking for me, boy, they know where to look at, man. Hey, Binga. No, you are. <laughs> he want to point fingers at me. He done told the whole world. Stop playing. Like you, you didn't gave you, you you didn't gave out our government names <laughs> once. <laughs> that, that's her. No, that's her. no, because the time that I did say your whole entire name, guess what? I edited it out of that episode. That's now that's you, that. sir, you, you what? said when, your whole entire name. When 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 have I said your whole name? When have I said Lash's whole name, bro? Not once, bro. Damn, bro. Come on. Stop filming me, bro. No, but you said your whole name by yourself, <laughs> dummy. Anybody? No, I think that I think there is an episode that I that I heard my last name on it. Anybody? Yes. That you, you, yes. You, you said you said my last name. You didn't say my first name, but you said my last name. Yes. Anybody? Yes. Hey, listen, hey, listen, man. I don't got nothing to hide. You know what I'm saying? And if, if anybody looking for me, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, it's not for smoke. You know what I'm saying? They they probably you know what I'm saying miss me though, but I don't I don't have I don't have enemies, bro. That's another position. Mm, yeah. That's another position that motherfuckers either need, need, need to cut out, bro. You know what I'm saying? Oh, niggas hate me. Niggas, niggas want smoke, nigga. Like nigga, I don't want no problem with nobody, bro. I'm yeah. stupid, bro. Like nigga, I'm I'm drinking. A, I'm in my flip so I'm drinking a cup of wine, my nigga. We you know, like nah, man. <laughs> man fuck that shit out, man. Yeah. I mean, some people, some people just got egos, man, and and, and like they want to be hated. They want. I heard something where like when you let when you let your ego take the steering wheel, you'll never get to your destination. Yeah. So it's like. That's another thing. Fuck all that. That's another thing that 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 we we wasn't we wasn't taught about, man. Ego, pride. That's the type of shit in, they need to teach in school. Not in college and elementary school. Facts. Big facts. Yeah. I mean, about saving, ego, cocaine, shit like that, bro. Really? <laughs> really? <laughs> that for real, man. I, I I had to get out of the third grade to to find out about cocaine, bro. Like my nigga, are you serious, my nigga? You you gonna tell me you you gonna tell me in the second grade, nigga? I, I could have been serving cocaine, nigga. I could have been rich, my nigga. Pay too goddamn much, bro. <laughs> yeah, but <laughs> uh-huh, I don't know. I don't think that shit is worth it. Oh, we man. talked about this shit the other day. Like, would you sacrifice? Five years of straight balling to either end up dead or in jail Absolutely. for the rest of your life. Absolutely not. That's another tradition that has to die. You know what I'm saying? That concept that that that, that the, the, if you the, the the concept of if you if you want to be a hustler, you have to sell dope. You know what I'm saying? That's, yeah. that's another yeah. tradition that has to die. It has to die. That tradition has to die, nigga. If you a hustler, if you a hustler, a hustler, you can hustle anything. And not just not not this yeah. shit, not this shit that puts you in prison, bro. Big facts. Fuck out. I mean, you you got you got dudes right now risking their life and their freedom. You know what I mean? Trying to hustle, hustle up some bread for like Christmas and shit. Baby mama on their back. Nigga, you ain't shit. That's a fact. Broke ass. You know what I'm saying? That's that's real shit. That's, nigga, that, that's somebody reality right now. Yeah, that's somebody. You ain't that, shit. That's somebody you reality. Pussy right ass, now. nigga. <laughs> that's that's why I'm fucking somebody. What? Nothing. Bum ass, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> See, look, I I to to this day, I have never disrespected. My chill, my my kids' fathers like that, ever, like, I don't even have the strength to even step up to them and be like, "You ain't shit, 
you ain't this, you ain't that, or whatever, whatnot. It's like, I don't have it in me. If you ain't doing what you got to do, I'm going to leave you alone. I'm not going to tell you nothing. I'm going to do what what I got to do. I'm going I'm to hustle for my, for my, for mine. You feel me? I'm going to do for mine. That's all right. One way or another, um, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get what my kids need, but I'm not gonna come at you, and and, and one disrespect you, two, come at you all lopsided and and, and you know, yo the try truth to is, get you money from you you know what I mean nah, the truth man. the truth okay. is like you know like maybe 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 my man fucked up man maybe my man don't got it maybe he fucked up bro. You know what I'm saying? And that's a reality, bro. Yo, I don't got it, bro. I can't do Christmas this year, bro. I'm I'm tapped out, bro. I'm 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 behind yeah. my, I'm, I'm behind on my car payments. I'm behind on my my insurance. I'm behind on on on, on my credit cards. My credit card bills, my bullshit. I'm fucked up. I mean, why do we have to? Why do we have to give gifts like to show what to show people that we love them? That no, that's bullshit. No, that's society that, that, just making you think you got to do that. That's fucking bullshit. Like, bro, like, I remember when people look down at this shit, but it's like, bro, what about what about the gift of my friendship, yo? What about the gift of my loyalty? What about the gift that of friendship that you gave to me? I'm, you know what I'm saying? I might not have it now. Either come on, sir. One day, but one day I'm going to give you something, and I'm not going to give it to you because it's Christmas. I'm going to give it to you because I fuck with you and I love you. You know, so another tradition that needs to be broken is my nigga, let's stop outdoing each other with the fucking insults and the no. disrespect. No, fuck that. Usted un sanoso, boy. Fuck that shit. <laughs> God damn. Fuck that shit. Son. Well, you know what? I I love you too, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. You know, you know what else that's a guy? Secret Santa. What's wrong with Secret mm. Santa? Nigga, these people at work try to sign me up for Secret Santa. I'm like, are you serious? <laughs> they don't let me know you people, bro. I ain't gonna spend my money on you people. <laughs> oh, my God, bro. oh my God. Like, oh, fuck. I think, hilarious. You know what we I do? Think secret, I think Secret Santa is the side nigga. Coño. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Nah, nigga, but you know, if, I, I work. I if, work. Her, if if hubby you don't got it, side nigga got it. Nah, nah, but you know that, that's what they do at work, son. They, you know, they they sign up for Secret Santa and shit like that. Oh, you got this person, you got that person, shit like that. You, you gotta buy something for so and so, bro. That is so on, fake. Under ten dollars, under twenty dollars, and shit like that. I don't got time for that shit. Thank you, goddamn much. Nigga, my, none. Nigga, I don't, I, I, that's why I like being faithful now, because it's cheaper. You know what I'm saying? You only got to buy gifts for one, for one woman and shit like that. It, it, it's cheaper, dog. It, it, like, like, I should have I should have started doing this years ago. I mean, like, for real. I mean, Otis... Otis said it a long time ago in, in, in the show, Martin. Otis, the security guard. It's cheaper to keep her. It's cheaper to keep her, that boy. He said it. No, it's not. OJ OJ had it right, nigga. What? OJ had it right, nigga. The fuck? <laughs> try me, I'm going to kill you. It's, it's cheaper to keep her, nigga. If, if, if you could afford it, like Jeff Bezos, nigga. Jeff Bezos gave that bitch power, nigga. He he didn't give her money. He gave her power. I gave you power. I made you buck wild. <laughs> and they gave her thirty billion like nothing. Like bro, I sneeze thirty billion. Yeah, man. Just fuck out of here. Can I go now, bro? You know, you know what else? You know what else needs to 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 die? This whole thing of I need to impress. Anybody? Why do we need to impress anybody? Oh, keeping up with the Joneses? Oh, that's yeah, that's, man. That's 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 dying. That's I, don't, I don't think that's going nowhere though. It needs to die though. I, I agree. Hate that though, I hate I, that. 
I agree, but I don't think that's going nowhere. That's 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 human nature. That's dumb. No. That's dumb because like there's a lot of people out here just acting like 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 they're all that in a bag of chips and, and deep down inside uh, they, uh, they, they they got nothing going on. They ain't shit. And I mean, like, what the, what are you afraid of uh, of showing? You know what what's really good with you? You know what what you what? It's funny. It's funny that in the year twenty twenty, right? They they made us put physical masks on, but m- m- motherfuckers have been walking around with masks for years, bro. For Thanks. years. Now is it, now, now it's just more more. It's it's more physical now. It's it, it's manifested. You know what I'm saying? But motherfuckers been wearing masks for years. Son, this year mm. has shown uh, who really has it and who don't got it. Because... As in, as in, as in what? All right, let me give you an example, right? So all these people that, you know, are trying to keep up with the Joneses and stuff, you know, oh, I got money, I got this, I got that, I got this, I got that. All right, were you able to maintain that throughout 2020? Mm-hmm. Because a lot of people lost a job, so were you able to maintain? Were you able to, uh, you know, keep 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 doing what you got to do? Because if if you really, you know, up there with the Joneses, then you have backup money to help you with whatever you need. Now I get it. Some people live paycheck to paycheck, and it doesn't, you know, it doesn't add up too much. I get it. You know, that's all right. That happens. But. These people who are love flashing out like to the max. I'm talking about like annoying, flashy, flashy. Yeah. Where the you show, at now? Show offs. Yeah. Where you at now? They're gonna come back at the tax season. Don't worry about it. <laughs> They're gonna pop up. Oh yeah. yeah. They're gonna pop up. Uh, like nothing. Uh, like nothing ever happened. Like nothing ever happened, boy. Nigga, we, oh, nigga, we, oh my god. My nigga, we here, boy, getting this money, baby. Boy, yeah, it's money. It's horrible. You ready to go back and smack them? But yeah, 20, 2020 exposed a lot of people and how they live in. Absolutely, yeah, that's a fact. Absolutely, it's real shit. Hold on, give me a second. Yeah. Oh, well, man. we uh, so this is this is the Christmas episode, but y'all get ready because because the New Year's episode is gonna be we we're trying to figure that out, but we're gonna do it live. Hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs> yeah. We live. can't put it out there yet, but we're, we're gonna hope hopefully make it live. So for all of those, all, all of y'all that are rocking with us, you know what I'm saying. Pull up on us. That's a fact. If 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 we're live. Yeah. What we're gonna do is like, we'll like on Twitch or YouTube or what? How? That that's the part where we gotta sit down and, and, and uh brainstorm, bro. Fuck it, let's do a zoom meeting, my nigga. <laughs> let's do a oh zoom my gosh. Let's do a zoom meeting, boy. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Listen. My my vacation starts on twelve thirty one, bro. So we doing a Zoom meeting. You're not gonna catch me wearing something nice. You're gonna catch me wrapped up in my blanket, bro. You could you, you laying could. down because I'm gonna be tired of working. <laughs> You're facing up. Sick of this shit. <laughs> right now, okay. right now, right now. Like I got a venom T-shirt on and sweatpants on and sandals, bro. I'm super comfortable. I'm super comfortable. I got a white tee and some. I'm super comfortable. I don't give a fuck some about. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I remember, I like I, I will I will wear the most uncomfortable shit just to be in style, bro. That's a that's a tradition that I killed years ago, but fuck that shit. I'm all for comfort. I'm all for comfort now, boy. Fuck that shit. I don't give a fuck. Spending spending two thousand dollars on a pair of jeans and some shit like that. Man, fuck you, man. The fuck I look like. 
Fuck out of here, man. Stop telling me, man. Yeah. Stop telling me. I ain't worrying about. I ain't worrying about. I want to make sure I got money in my pocket. You know. At the end of the day. You, you know who can wear a two thousand dollar pair of jeans and shit? LeBron, nigga. Not me. <laughs> nigga, I don't got LeBron money. What the? Why the fuck should I try to dress like him? The fuck? <laughs> Yeah, that's that's another thing too. Like, don't 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 go broke, don't go broke. Uh, spending money on gifts, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. For people, cause don't don't do it for the wrong reasons. You know what I'm saying? If if you're doing it, okay, you love your family, you fuck with them, everything like that. You you wanted to get your mom, uh, uh, you know what I'm saying? The little them 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 things that you know you put you put your feet in and there's bubbles and all that kind of shit. You always wanted that. Cool, get her that. You know what I'm saying? Um, whatever it is. But if you're doing it to fucking, you know, act like you the shit or, or you want to look good for everybody, nah, for, man. For, if, for, if, it, if, for if it's for the gram. For the gram. Yep. yep. Oh, my God. You already know how I feel about that. Doing for it the for the gram. Nigga, I, I bought my nigga last some sixes, nigga. For the gram. <laughs> nigga, for the gram, nigga. What the fuck? Fuck out of here, bro. <laughs> Nigga, to appear or not to appear? Yeah, real shit, real shit, real shit. I really feel that when you give somebody something, when you give somebody something, it's because you want to give to them. Now, if if, you, if if I give if I give Liz Liz two hundred dollars, you know what I'm saying, with the camera right in front of her face, that's that's something else. Yeah. That, that's something else, bro. That that's not that's not kindness, bro. That's not kindness, bro. Eso es, eso es, eso es sacando en cara, low key. Yeah, that's like when the people always go on Instagram and be like, "Oh, look, I'm passing out hundred dollar bills to the poor yeah. people." Yeah, bro. And it's yeah. like, why are you trying to show off the world what you're doing? Like, if you, that if should you, just that should come from you. Be humble that you're doing. If you, this. if you it's better somebody else's life. If you really own that, you wouldn't seek that validation, bro. Oh, look. Yeah. I'm a good nigga. Look what I did. I gave. I broke bread with these with, with, with these people. I'm broke bread. No, I, I I fed I fed these people. Nah, man. You yeah. need that validation, man. That that sucker shit. <laughs> Six nine passed out hundred dollar bills, but put an entire an entire organization in prison. Football numbers. Yeah, bro. yeah, but see, he didn't what? record himself though. Like, did he record himself or somebody recorded him? I mean, he 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 did it. He did it in videos. Uh, but he a sucker. You know what I mean? He, he a sucker in a snitch. Like, like, come on, man. Don't don't mention that nigga in our podcast, man. Fuck that nigga, bro. <laughs> nigga a snitch, bro. Oh my god, <laughs> I can't. Like, come on, man. You got a snitch, man. You, 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 you co-sign that shit? You vouch for that shit? <laughs> no, hell no. God, what the fuck? You, you misunderstanding this. Oh, fuck that nigga. And fuck what that nigga do, bro. That, that nigga a rat, bro. That nigga a rat. I'm not a big fan of his. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, we don't do that over here. No. on yeah, I'm not, I'm not li- Lyrically, lyrically on the mic, that nigga need to go have a freestyle battle with Pop Smoke and, 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 and Nipsey Hussle in them, bro. That nigga need to die, bro. <laughs> that nigga needs to die, wow. bro. That's it. Okay, okay. That's it. That nigga, Jesus Christ. That nigga, that, 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 that boy, that boy is one of the worst rappers I ever heard in my life, son. Oh, uh, <laughs> Takashi Six Nine. Thank for for Christmas, you should get the COVID nineteen and die, Ooh. bro. That's oh, what I'm saying. Wow. That's what I'm, that's what I'm saying, bro. Like here you go. Here we go, nigga. That's it. That's, go for go go for extra wood. Go freestyle with Tupac in them, nigga. You you're dead now. Jeez. Oh Lord. Oh my gosh. He went all the way. Well, damn, dumb oh, ass thing. Rat bastard. <laughs> they got a rat. They got a rat. Someone, bitch. Ah, uh, fuck it. Yeah, fuck that guy. Fuck him, man. Come on, man. You're a rat, man. 
You 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 know how many Christmases niggas is going to miss because of, because of that niggas actions, bro. Yeah, because they, because they gave because, their their lives he, for him. Because he didn't because he he didn't break tradition. Niggas been snitching for years, bro. Niggas been giving up niggas for years. Mafia niggas, gangster niggas. Yeah. Niggas been snitching for years. I was going to say that. Like, bro, that's another tradition that you got to break. You know what I mean? If you're not, if you're not built stop. for this shit, if you're not built for this shit, don't fucking go in there, yo. Don't don't call yourself a gangster if you're not a gangster. Don't call yourself a hustler, a, a, a dope boy, or whatever the fuck it is. You want to get in that life, you got to you gotta deal with what comes with it. You know what I mean? And take and take and take it like a man. Gotta cut that shit out, man. You got you, you gotta cut that shit out. You, you, you once you get money on the street, you're not you're not a civilian no more. Yeah. Another thing too, like you know what I mean, don't uh be safe this Christmas. You know what I'm saying? Be safe. Be with the ones you love. Um and yeah, man, just wear, wear your, your mask. fucking mask, bro. Please, goodness. If you follow us on Instagram and, and you check out some of the stuff that we, you know, a lot of places that we've been going or whatever, whatnot, like it, it's amazing how people don't wear masks. And I, and I just be looking and I'm just be like, oh, and spontaneous, spontaneous order 2020, follow us. Can I say something? Yes. And don't fucking kill yourself, bro. Don't kill yourself because yeah. you know this is the holiday season. This is the the, uh, the peak season for hot for for suicide. Bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't kill yourself. If, if you think about that shit, find me on Instagram or Facebook or Twitter. And I'll 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 fuck with you, bro. Talk to me, bro. I'm a fucking psychologist too. Bro. <laughs> I'm not, oh my god! <laughs> I, 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 you know, I'm not. A, I'll sit down and with you. I just want you to fucking kill yourself, bro. Oh my god. I'll sit down, I'll be with you, nigga. Probably beat your ass and some man and some shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, this, this fuck with me, bro. You, you don't have to kill yourself, bro. Don't take the holidays so serious. That that's Facts. what it is. Facts. You can't bro. take it Facts. too serious, man. Facts. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. That's something that society put together, man, and and it, and it drives it drives anybody crazy, man. It's, it's society, dumb shit. Like what? Like what the fuck? I mean, it, it all it all moves on. You know what I'm saying? Christmas moves on. Then the thirty, then New Year's. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Look at 2020. 20, 2020 is getting ready to move on. It, it it it's it's been fucking kicking the shit out of us the whole year and it's about to leave you know what i'm saying so what 2021 has in store we don't know but you know what i'm saying try your best not to unravel bro and i'm not i'm not i'm not an optimist bro so i'm expecting more 2020 and 2021 mm. bro that's, that's it i'm not enough mm. I, i'm i'm just focused on getting me bro and, and reaching my accomplishing my goals bro ain't no new year new me shit Cause I've been the same me for the for the last thirty four six fucking years, bro. Fuck all that. Oh, I can't shit. stand that New Year New Me shit. That shit is so fucking tacky. Yeah, it is. It is. Well, save that conversation for for the for the New Year's. Facts. Episode. All right, we out. We out. We out. It's dinner time. I gotta eat. I gotta eat. All right, y'all. All right, then eat. It's your boy Laz. Y'all be careful. Be safe and merry Christmas. Yes, yeah, in this loop. Merry Christmas, right. y'all. Happy holidays. We is out. We out. We out. We out.